Okay, this is our function 1 and 2. So, our UI to do the browse and let the folder. You look at the CC file. Apply. So, the data will be arranged nicely in the table format. Okay, we're going to do the data processing. Okay, this is right. So, it will split the file into text file. Okay. Okay, function 3. So, this is our data set. We go to process. We choose by agency. Group at the start. For agency, you can start by descending order and descending order. A copy of CSV file save at our data folder. So this is a CSV file. Okay. So this is the function 4. We have a data set. The base file, we choose the supplier name. Same value. We upload the list of the vector to do the comparison. We choose the today name and data. We apply. So this is a list of the registered computers. So we're going to see our data at the CSV. Okay, for function 5, okay, uh, we need to generate out the, the list of uh, non registered suppliers. Okay, so we will apply. So our file here, we have non registered and registered suppliers. Okay, so we can use our function okay, to group by. Okay, means we have to select the file again to go to the comparison data, choose the non registered suppliers, this is the list, then we're going to select by the first name and sum. So this is the sum that they choose the suppliers. They are not in the list. Not in the list. Okay. So to see the supplier in the list, okay. we first of all again, we drop down select by the data processing supplier name sum. So all these sums, okay. Uh, registered suppliers. Okay, so now we're going to find the top five. Okay, top five awarded. So we're going back to the common again. Five. We have our data analysis. We choose the square name. The order amount. We choose I. So the system will show you the top five. Okay. Okay, uh, this is our pie chart. And we will save the image here. We can also do the we can also do the bar chart. Okay, this is the bar chart. Okay, I'm going to talk about function 6. So, we have the data ready. So, we do a data search. Okay, by transport function. This criteria will be our data description. We do a search. So, we list out all the uh, agencies. They are categorized by transportations. And we save to our data. Okay, in our data data. Okay, so what I need to do is we need to use that our file manager, the file manage file. We will retrieve out okay, 
our script data SSB hypothesized okay so that we use our data processing okay to process based on the agency and to type sum so you were able to see that okay, how much the agency spend on transportation category the amount that's it okay we do the open function so we unlock any data set okay from the CSV files we do data processing and analysis so for example we get the government expenditures on the internet okay so this is the table format so we do the data processing so I want to find out how much the ministry spend it okay so we have generated another data set okay uh, after the data processing okay so we be based on the new data set okay we're going to do the data analysis okay so what i do is i want to know the ministry and the amount of the sum okay so we put the ministry so we can see the nine graph okay so if how can I see in my image format it's over here okay so this is the nine graph that has the ministry standing okay we based on the um, ministry time that we have created okay we also can do the top five okay, in the pie chart Okay, uh, based on the Pokemon file, okay, we have one uh, category we can do the classify, okay, based on the our libraries, classify libraries. So, by the way, we do the export function. by the editor description so from the classify okay the library will classify get the standard distribution okay let's see the result okay as you can see from the description here we okay, will automate it to the um, classification edit so I see from So based on this library, we are able to classify okay, based on keywords okay, from the standard description. Okay. okay, we have one more uh, function, which is called the uh, sentiment analysis. We will use this for access file, CSV file, for example. Okay, mysteries, okay. So the result will give us the scores. And you can see the subjectivity and priority. So we're going to put up the data. Okay, so this two scores here. So we need zero and this 